Today is March 17th. Pastor is saying to us, make the truth known. Our opening scripture comes to the book of John chapter 8 verse 32. And you shall know the truth, and the truth shall make you free. In these last days, the strategy of the enemy is to destroy many with fear and deception. But the way to tackle and cure the effects of the But the way to tackle and cure the effects of deception is by making the truth known. And that's why we are so grateful to God for Rhapsody of Realities. Through it, we are making the truth known every day, in every nation, and in every known and living language of the world. Blessed be God. Be a part of the great crusade of spreading the truth to the nooks and crannies of the earth through the distribution of Rhapsody of Realities in all languages of the world to all all nations. God wants to protect his people. He wants to guide and lead them. And he does this through the word and the Holy Spirit. Let's make his truth known. When people don't know the word of God, they get deceived and destroyed. God said, my people are destroyed for their lack of knowledge. Not only should you consciously increase in your knowledge of God, Help others to know the word. Jesus said in Matthew chapter 28 verse 19, Go ye therefore and teach all nations. In other words, teach them the truth. Show them how to live so they're not deceived. Anyone who's ignorant of the word of God is in darkness because the word of God is truth and light. It's the same for anyone who's destitute of the Holy Spirit. For the Holy Spirit is spirit of truth. He's the one who guides you into all truth, so you can walk in truth and also make it known to others. His truth, his word, is your shield and buckler. Psalm chapter 91 verse 4. That's why you need to have your attention on the word. It liberates you and dispels the darkness. Please say this prayer with me. Dear Father, thank you for your word that causes me to stay in truth and walk in your perfect will. As your children all around the world, make your truth known. Your righteousness is established around the world. In Jesus' name, amen. For further study, please read 1 John chapter 4, verse 1, 1 John chapter 4, verses 5 to 6, and Psalm chapter 91, verse 4. For the one-year Bible reading plan, Please read Luke chapter 1 verses 57 to 80 and Deuteronomy chapters 8 to 10. For the two-year Bible reading plan, please read Matthew chapter 23 verses 23 to 39 and Exodus chapter 26. There is an unprecedented stirring of the waters Ow. and the healing streams are flowing again. It's flowing to every nation, every city, and every home. There's anything that has been wrong in your life, especially your body, God's peace can get a hold of your system and bring an end to the sickness that you have been going through. It's time for an unforgettable outpouring of the miraculous at the Healing Streams Live Healing Services with Pastor Chris this March, from Friday the 17th to Sunday the 19th of March, 2023. God sent me to you to bring you His healing. That's why I can utter words from Him. And it doesn't matter where you are in this great world. As I speak those words, the disease, the sickness, the infirmity has no option than to leave you. This is your set time for a miracle. Register now at www.healingstreams.tv slash LHS. For more details, call the number showing on your screen. The services will be broadcast live on www.healingstreams.tv and on the Healing School mobile app. The Healing Streams Live Healing Services with Pastor Chris. Your set time for your healing.